Alright, hey guys, my name is CJ, and today I'm playing Dead or Alive 2 for the PS2. Now, before we get into anything, I just want to quickly say that I have never played a Dead or Alive 2 game uh, until recently when I started playing this game. When I say Dead or Alive 2 game, I never played Dead or Alive. That's, that's, that's what I was looking for. I've never played Dead or Alive, um, and I don't know why, I've just never had the game. Um, and I've seen people play it throughout the years, but I've, I've never really bothered to try it out myself and it's okay I mean I um, I played it through recently with like three like three characters and so far um, Kasumi is my favorite character and I'm gonna be using her in in this video but the end boss fight I tried going through this with um, fuck, I, I, I can't even remember his name but he's one of the he's a Taekwondo dude with uh, green hair. I can't remember his name, but I went to the game as him, and it was okay. Um, I first used Gen Fu or Gen Fu, whatever, however the fuck you pronounce his name. I used him, but I couldn't get past a certain fight. Um, and then I used the dude with the green hair. I don't remember his name. Used him because he had very fast kicks. He's fucking quick, and it was it was right. It was right up. Up until I got to the boss fight with Tengu, who is the final boss. Up until I got to the boss fight with Tengu, everything was fine. Next minute, when I get to the boss fight with Tengu, I could not lay a finger on this fucker. Every time I go and do an attack, you would counter, um, you would counter everything. And don't even try to throw that asshole, because the minute you try to go and throw him, he will throw you immediately. It is absolutely insane. So, you just need to constantly hit the fucker with as many confusing attacks as you can and Kasumi is amazing for that so I'm going to be using Kasumi in this I just did a, a run through with Kasumi to see if I could you know beat Tengu and it is possible so yeah I don't have any any words to say there's like no strategy you has got to blindly fucking attack it's it's insane although the the combat in this is is actually really really nice I I do enjoy it it's, it's really really cool um, what else to say? Yeah, the the music in this is is okay. The stages are alright. Um, it's it's not quite Tekken level um, or God of War. Uh, God of War, um, Mortal Kombat level. But it it is good nonetheless. Um, but still, that boss fight with Tengu. Oh my fuck, bro! Another thing to talk about is just the voice acting is complete dog shit. I mean, you'll see me critique this a lot in games. I can't stand when there's horrible voice acting. Now, I'm not saying that I'm a good voice actor myself. I've, um, I probably couldn't do better than these guys, okay? But that's not really the point. The point is they could have chose anybody to do better voice acting than this. It just sounds absolutely atrocious. It's... <sighs> You'll see what I mean later on when we get playing as Kasumi. We'll have to fight, um, Ryu Hayabusa. Who, by the way, is actually in Ninja Gaiden. Uh, any case, w when we fight him, the voice acting, oh my soul, it's fucked. Through, it makes me cringe how horrible it is. I hate it. Okay. <sighs> Just want to say something. If you put this on anything other than medium, you are a masochist, okay? Because Tengu is fucked even on easy difficulty. But anyways, guys, I've been rambling on about this long enough. Let's get into this and... Yeah, let's do story battle with Kasumi. So, so who we got? We got Kasumi, got Genfu, or well, have you pronounced his name? Tina Armstrong, Zach. There we go, Zach. I, pl I played through as this guy because he's quite cool, but couldn't get past Tengu, man. Jan Lee. I tried using him. He didn't really appeal to me. I mean, he is. He does use Jeet Kundo, which is you know the, the Bruce Lee fighting style. No, sorry, it's a fighting system. Um, it's a fighting system that Bruce Lee made up and. You know, I thought he'd be quite cool, but he's not really. Ayane, she's okay. Ayn. He's just a, he's a strange character, this guy. Lei Fang. Tai Chi Kwan, I, I don't know. I haven't played as her. Leon is irritating. I play, you know, when I use Gen Fu uh, in, my, in my first playthrough of this game, I could not get past this fucker. Th this was the guy that I, that I got stuck on. This guy will constantly throw you. And drive you and drive you drive you crazy. It's mm -mm. all right. Moving on before I get before I get angry. Even before we play, you know, start the playthrough. 
Um, Bess Armstrong, or Bass Armstrong, however you pronounce this guy's first name. I assume it's Bess. Six foot five, he's one big motherfucker. 346 pounds. Yes, see, bro. This guy's heavy. Alright, um. Yeah, he's about like 100 or so, 160 kilograms, something like that. I don't know, he's, he's fucking heavy. Alright, so. Helena. Don't really care. And Rai Hayabusa. This guy's a bit of a pain in the ass to fight, but anyways. Let's do this with Kasumi. Here we go. Choosing a normal outfit, because why not? I am the winner! Alright, let's go, Jen Lee. Get ready, fight! So, uh, Kasumi's got some really nice combos as well. Here we go, done. I didn't even take a hit. What kind of laugh was that? Oh, shit, alright, I gotta focus. Alright, yeah, kasumi has got some nice throws as well. Fuck, let me do some throws! Fuck. Get up. Shit. I love that throw. That, that... Move right there is actually very, very good. Fuck, ah, don't kill me, don't kill me. It's very cool because it hits them low. Shit, that was close. It's very good because if you're at a distance from them, you can press forward, forward, kick, and um, she'll jump and do a low attack. So it's very, very nice. Very useful for fighting against uh, the AI in this game. I promised Hayate, I cannot let you die. I cannot let you go. Remember that the way of the shinobi is a harsh one. No way of the shinobi is a harsh one. I cannot let you go. What the fuck kind of voice acting is that? Alright, but Ryu is a piece of piss. Okay, he's fucking easy. Oh shit. Uh, oh shit. Get out. Yeah, so this game is actually really, really short. The, the playthrough of this is really, really quick. Alright, she just disappeared like that. I don't know what the fuck happened there. Alright, so I assume this is where we have to fight Genfu. I think. Oh no, it's Tina, okay. Shit. Fuck, get off me. There we go. Get out. I love playing as Kasumi, she's awesome. I have no time to spare. Goodbye. She just disappeared again. Did a toilet really and then she disappeared. Always with a heroine. Get ready. Alright, Ayana can be a bit of a bitch to, to fight. Ooh, fuck. Damn it, man. Fucking hell! Don't you dare kill me, please. I just realized I'm not blocking at all. I don't think it's necessary to block. Unless you're playing on like the really difficult difficulties, you know. It's not necessary to block. You know me? Aren't you my brother? 
Alright, this guy also a bit of a dickhead to fight. Just keep on top of him and he won't cause you any stress whatsoever. And he's done. That didn't take a hit. You gotta be so damn aggressive with this guy. Aren't you my brother? I don't I don't understand that. Everything is mine. Everything is my delusion. Fuck, this sounds so fucking mechanical. Fuck! Yeah, I, I, okay, Tengu. This asshole is very. Oh shit. He likes to fuck, grab you. He does a shitload of damage when he does. Shit, and, and he counters your moves a lot. Ooh. Shit, you see there? Alright, I'm dead. I expect to lose quite a bit on this. I don't even think it's wise to even throw him, because watch what happens if you do. Oh, I, I did it. Look, wait, wait. I think that was a bit lucky. Watch. I'm gonna try to throw him. See, he just counters your throw instantly, so don't even bother throwing this guy. Fuck. Oh, come on, I, I need to focus. Get up! Fuck, don't kill me. Motherfucker, he just... Oh, I got close there. Yeah, I gotta focus here. Shit, get off me. Fuck. Shit, man. Fuck. How does he do that? Goes through my combos like that. Fuck, I'm dead. Alright, let's go. I get so bloody close the whole time and then you just fuck, you know. Damn it, man. Get off! That did a shitload of damage. This is where you lose all the time. Get ready! Please don't kill me. Get out! There we go, fuck you. And there we go, that's it. That is literally it. The game just ends like that. 15 minutes and we're done. More or less. How's about that? It's so... look, okay. It's a good fighting game, but it's just so unfulfilling. I think there's an ending piece, I'll just wait for these things to to finish, there's like a end cutscene that, you know, plays once the credits are done. I could be wrong, but it's just like, huh? You fight Tengu and then it just, just ends like that. Alright, let's see the voice actors here. Aoni Pro, Kasumi was Sakura Tange. Who played Hayabusa? Oh wait, these are the Japanese voice actors. Who played the English voice actors? That's what I want to know, they sound dog shit. I don't care about the Japanese voice actors, I'm talking about the English voice actors. 
horrible voice actors. Their image voice is produced by Berkeley Sound Artists. You guys are horrible. You guys are horrible. Here we go. Brian Douglas, Donna, Mass Wong, Gina Ross, Jeremy Ho. All of these guys. You guys suck. Here we go. So I've, I've made my rant about the voice acting like yet again. Ugh. So what else is there to do now? It's it's like 15 minutes and then we're just done. Very very short. You know? Team Ninja 2000, interesting. Home. I want to go home. Okay. So I don't know what that cutscene was all about, but it was a random cutscene. Just a chick saying, I want to go home. Okay. I have no idea what else to say. Other than this was really, really short playthrough. It was easy. Look. There's no middle ground between the, uh, between the easy difficulty and medium difficulty. Once you get to medium... It steps up the game, my bro. It really, really does. So, yeah. Let's consume me doing a little bit of a... You can't really call that a kata, but... Leave now. This is not a simple combat championship. I don't think you commoners can handle it. your mouth shut! That sounds horrible. I can't get over that. We okay, but yeah, that that was that was a fun playthrough, but it was very short. If if they could add like a few more characters, it would be better, you know, a few more characters to fight. Not make a sibling difficult, so uh, would be nice. And majority of your your um, your replays are gonna be done on fucking Tengu. Tengu is a pain in the ass to fight. Like I said, don't even try to throw the asshole because you, you try and throw him. Yo. The minute you try and throw him, that's that's it. Done. Game over. So you need to just There's no strategy, just button mash. So use your kick combos and use your punch combos at random times. Use different combos, like I mean different single attacks. You know? But yeah. That's that's pretty much just how to get through Tengu, and I I can only do it with Kasumi. I tried play I, I tried playing through with Zack and Genshu, and uh, I didn't get I didn't make it. Uh, they were useless. Interesting. So why? How dare you, swindler! I I don't get who that is, but yeah. Wow, you came all the way here? You. Yeah. Oh no, you. You killed my mother. What the fuck? Like, wow, you came all the way out here? You. What? You killed my mother. Like, it, it sounds so fucking robotic, it's hilarious to me. It's like, it's like, you just get there, there's no emotion whatsoever. Like what? All the words gotta 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 That's that's all I heard. I don't know what else to say about voice acting other than that voice acting was dog shit because you know there's no emotion. She was like you, you killed my mother, and then that just starts a fight with no emotion. I don't understand this. But that was a nice little cutscene that we got there. But anyways guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I plan to do more more things like this, like more Dead or Alive games, and maybe some Tekken games and other games as well. But if you guys have any other suggestions for me to play games, you know, or, or for games for me to play, that's the right way to put it. 
then uh, tell me in the comments because I'm really interested to see what you guys want to see. Alright, so thank you both so much for watching. Tell me what you guys want to see me do next. I really hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next one. I'm out.